thumbnail. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It has been a hot minute since I made a video. Life has just been absolutely crazy in the best way. Um, I went to a camp reunion, saw a lot of good old friends, then I went and visited family, and then I moved to a new place, which is where I am right now. And I'm probably, I'm cropping this so you guys can't see that it is just an utter disaster. A vlog is coming soon, an apartment tour once I get it all situated. But I just feel like I always forget how long it takes you to get settled into a new place. All of that to say that I am really excited to be filming my first video here in my new, it's, a, it's an apartment, but it's also a townhouse, so I don't really know what to call it, but my new home. So today I'm super excited to be bringing you guys a fall fashion haul. Didn't mean for that to rhyme, but it worked. Um, I went to H&M yesterday and went to Target, not with the intention of buying clothes, but I went to H&M to get a Halloween costume and to return one I had gotten. And then I had never been to the H&M um, here in Fort Worth and it's very nice. It's like four stories and I was like, oh, oh. So spent a good amount of time there, bought some really, really cute pieces. I wanted to make this video so that you guys know that I just bought this stuff. Like this stuff is still very well, like very much in stock. So that if you see anything you like, I'm gonna have it all linked down in the description box below. And then I went to Target, and I went to Target to find a rug, which I found in addition to like four new items of clothes. So, like the way my Target is set up, it's like if you park on the left, like if you park on like by the left side entrance, it's like clothes. And so you know what you're getting yourself into. If you park on the right side, it's like um, beauty, food, things like that. So you can easily avoid it. Well, I always park on the left because duh, I wanna look, so duh. But also I was inspired to go to Target after watching one of my favorite vloggers, Carrie Dayton. I'm gonna put her also in the description box below for you guys to check her out. She recorded a video recently about doing a full try on haul from the Target label Target label Wild Fable, it's a weird sentence. Um, and I really like Wild Fable. Sometimes their sizes are a little off for me, but I did find some really, really cute pieces from them yesterday. So I'm very excited to share that with you guys. So, thumbnail. I just wanna also preface this with that this video is in no way sponsored. I just love clothes. I'm a little bit of an addict. We are working on it, we're getting through it, whatever. So. Today is the 28th, I believe, of October, and I am really excited for Halloween. Halloween is one of my favorite holidays. Some people hate it, I love it. And this year I'm actually doing two costumes, and so one of my costumes, I am not gonna give it away yet because I don't like telling too many people I'm one of those weirdos, but. Um, so I ordered a costume from H&M, like an outfit, for this, for this person I'm being, and the pants were see-through, so I was like, not the look we're going for. So I went to H&M to return, and like I said, walked out with way more than I needed. Like, way more. Like, this sparkly deep V jumpsuit, which I hope you guys can see like how wonderfully sparkly this is. Guys, <laughs> this was $12. <laughs> Just let that sink in. And it is so, honestly, it fits so well. I absolutely love it. Uh, what I love about this jumpsuit is that it is stretchy. And I bought this in the size large. I think this would be really cute like for a night out or for dinner with friends with like a leather jacket um, or even to a wedding, you know, in the winter time when it's cold, you could wear this with a nice jacket, things like that. Um, very cute. So that's item number one. I am such a sucker for accessories. Like I have way too many but I love them so much. One pair of sunglasses I am super excited to share with you guys that I, y'all might think I'm crazy, I don't care. I have been looking for yellow aviators for a long time. I saw this pair of yellow aviators at Banana Republic, I remember this so vividly, Banana Republic, um, and like, oh gosh, I don't even know, like what, some part of Manhattan um, in March. And I wanted them so badly and I regretted not buying them, but they were about $100 and I was like, I can't do that. Oh, yesterday, I found these at H&M and it was like, not even a question. Had to buy them. I 
love these and they are ten dollars and then I also am a sucker for earrings and these were also ten dollars and I just couldn't pass them up I think they are so precious and I think these are kind of earrings that you would find like made well for like fifty dollars but finding these at H&M I also love big earrings so these were like a no-brainer for me then my last thing for accessories were these barrettes and I have totally been in the barrette uh, I don't know trend or whatever I have loved barrettes for a long time and I finally figured out how to wear them. These say happy and love. They're so cute. Okay, hey, you know that stuff that they put at the cash register that you're like, I know why they're putting that there and it's because it's gonna be a last minute decision that I don't need. Yeah, these. I mean, I absolutely love them, so that's fine. And that makes me feel better about the fact that I bought them and I didn't need them. They are $15, which like, I didn't look at the price when I bought them, which I normally don't do that. That is something that, that was definitely an impulse for me. Okay, so second for clothes, this was a piece that I saw and I was like, if that doesn't fit me, I'm going to be so sad. So it is this distressed denim jacket. You guys can see it's distressed on the back as well, on the, like, the shoulders and on the bottom. This jacket is one of those pieces that I put on in the dressing room and I immediately was like, yep. Yeah. Like didn't even like take me a second. I was like 100%. I got this in a medium. I'm gonna try it on for you guys. It's still pretty big on me. Like, I really like the oversized fit, but you know, if you wanted something more slim cut, this is definitely more supposed to, this is supposed to fit more oversized. And I normally wouldn't wear it with like, kind of like my big, like puffy Mexican tops, but this is so cute for fall over a sweater. Um, yeah, I'm obsessed with it. I mean, I love the Detroit, dis I love the distress detail. I think it is so much fun. Yeah, this was a piece that I seriously, like even the girl that was checking me out, we became friends. And she was like, I love this jacket. As soon as we got it in, I bought it. And I was like, girl, same. Yeah, I got a medium. This jacket was a little expensive. It's $40, but I honestly wear denim jackets all the time, especially in fall. It's definitely something I love to wear with a sweater. So, I love that jacket. The other two items I bought from H&M was this kind of silk midi skirt and this really beautiful kind of grayish blue. I think this would be so great for work or like a fun event or even a night out. So fun, love this. I actually bought these two um, to go maybe as an outfit. And so I also bought this navy chenille sweater if I can get it right here. It looks black but it's actually navy and the sweater was 35 and the skirt was 35. so in the skirt i'm a 12 um and then the sweater i'm a large so i think these would look super cute together or separate i love oh they're all dropping <laughs> we're fine i love a chanel sweater like Mmm, feels so good on my skin. Mm, feels so good on my skin. So something I do want to like note about this skirt is it comes up pretty high, but also um, my underwear line is showing. So this is a, like a garment or item that's going to require you to wear Spanx or something to smooth you underneath, just so that line is not visible. Since you guys are at a really awkward angle and you can't see like the full outfit, I am going to do a quick little like pan down. So this is the skirt. Like I said, it's a beautiful color, but also like that line right there is my underwear. And so that's something that is not ideal. Wow guys, these camera angles, so good, so flattering, so profesh. I think this is gonna be an awesome outfit for fall, winter, and all that entails. It's also, this outfit is kind of bringing out my blue eyes and I'm here for it. That's what I got at H&M. Now let's get into Tarte. I'm sorry, did I just have a brain fart? Now let's get into the Target bag. Here, I went to Target to find a rug and I found that rug, but I also found some clothes. Oops. One of my pieces that I got from Target, that was again one of those things that you go into the dressing room and you put it on and you're like, yes, yes, this is going home with me. Like, 
yes no question about it it's velvet joggers these like i can't even describe to you guys how awesome these pants are like they're just beautiful and my camera's not focusing and now it is they're just that was a really creepy smell okay enough of that they're just beautiful pants i love velvet it makes me feel like it's actually the winter time even though yesterday in texas it was 85 but these pants are by a new day which is another target brand i got an xl maybe could have sized down but i really kind of wanted them to be that like loose jogger fit because i think these would be so cute with a great sweater even like a white tee and a leather jacket or something but like you could pair this with so many different things you could wear sneakers you could wear some heels so many options love these these were uh 27 dollars i can't even like emphasize enough just like how amazing these feel on my like on my legs like they just they feel like butter it's amazing i will say something funny that's like definitely real life and isn't gonna be shown on instagram or advertised is that um i haven't shaved in a while and so they're kind of sticking to my legs like static electricity so that's cute and girly um these pants are probably my number one favorite thing i've got like in this whole haul i think they are so versatile and so comfortable don't think i can say that enough like i wish you guys could just like feel like like butter guys butter okay i'm gonna stop being a freak and keep going so next up from target this was definitely inspired by Carrie Dayton in her recent video because I saw her try this outfit on and I was like I have to go get that outfit like like to a T she actually ended up not like loving it but I thought it looked so cute on her and I was like I I need that in my closet so the girl went out and bought it and also I think it's funny because these are two pieces that like if I just saw them on the rack I would be like no but the way that Carrie styled them, I fell in love with them and I was like, wait, that's actually so cute. And when I put them on, even separately, I loved them. So the first piece is this kind of like mesh turtleneck. It has this slight ruching at the neck. It was like right here. It is a kind of like floral pattern, if you guys can see. Um, and what I love about this is that it is see-through. However, it comes with a tank already built in on the inside, which is great. Love that. Pairing that, off with this corduroy overall dress which i think i might have talked about this before i'm not sure but overalls are not my friend like i have tried on so many i want them to work so badly but just the way they fall on my body they fall in an area like i'll step back and kind of show you guys so they fall like right here on me and my waist is here and so they lick me they make me look bigger in a way than i am these are so cute i will say i got an extra large and they're a little big in the top so i'm definitely gonna have to adjust that a little bit but layering this with this like i said unexpected is so cute um the turtleneck is by wild fable and it was 18 dollars. but wild fable i always have to go up a size it's just the way it goes especially with any target brand i usually have to go up a size so um this wild fable corduroy dress was also an extra large um and this is 28 dollars. so here is the wild fable top i was telling you guys about the kai neck the turtleneck a little ruching here i think this top is so fun for fall i also realize that every time i move closer to the camera the light changes so that's my bad but i am wearing this just right now with my wild fable jeans like tucked in with some booties i think would be such a look and so cute especially with a leather jacket which i like to pair with everything now i'm gonna put this with the overalls to let you guys kind of see what that looks like okay so here is the look i hope you guys can see it fully um like i said i'm not normally an overall kind of girl but these are a little big right here and i think honestly just getting them cinched in just like a smidge would do this like wonders um the top is a little big on me but i think after tightening these it should be fine the reason i had to go for an extra large was like i said numerous times i uh, girl's got a little bit of a behind and so that always affects the way sizing works for me so i think this look will be so cute with tights doc martens booties really so many different options for this so the last 
piece from Target, which I feel like everybody needs a pair of these in their life. Like they are, I wear them so much in the winter time when I get kind of lazy and I don't wear jeans anymore. I bought these faux leather leggings. They are amazing. I will say I probably could have sized down to a large, but I, I don't know, I just got kind of nervous and I was like, I would never, I don't want leggings to be too tight where you're uncomfortable. So I did get an extra large and these are $16, also by Wild Fable. Um, what really inspired me to get these was I have a pair of Spanx, like leather leggings like this that were, I think I got from Christmas one year and they were like $98. So they're not like, like they're a pretty penny. So these are basically like the cheaper version of that and they fit so well. Um, I'm 5'8", I didn't have a problem with them being too short. Yeah, for $16, these are amazing. Um, thick band, super stretchy, highly, highly recommend these. And like, come on, these are so, like they fit so well. And they're $16, like what? Yeah, I love them. Mm. Thumbnail. Run, don't walk, go get a pair. They are amazing, I love them. They're also high rise. Don't know if I said that, they're amazing. I'm not gonna try on the jumpsuit just because I kind of want to save that for Halloween. It's gonna be so much fun. And that's also just a couple days. So if you just follow me on Insta, plug in that right here then you can see my full Halloween costume. Guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. Thank you for following along and sticking with me in my spastic behavior, my crazy life, all of the above. Before I go, I do wanna let you guys know that I have started a blog. I love to write and it really, I was just in a time of my life where I just decided that I have a lot of stories and I wanna share them with you guys and share them with the world. So. Um, yeah, I'm sharing my passion with you over on thiswildamazinglife.com. You can click on that link and see the three blog posts that I have uploaded and that are live. I am trying to load one or two a week. We'll see how long I can keep that up. But yeah, I'm still sticking with YouTube, trying to grow this channel, but I also just wanted to really grow and challenge myself with another passion of mine. So would love for you guys to check that out. Thank you so much for watching. Please subscribe. Give this video a thumbs up. I love you all and I will see you next time. Bye.